Alright, so loser semis, Inkling versus Greninja. I guess Dyer is actually opting to go for that Inkling instead of the wolf. Maybe just he, uh... Oh, what, I don't know. What, what just I, happened? That I, was yeah. sort of like, he threw the bomb and then nothing. I, I don't know. I'm confused. Anyways, we're going into it. FD game one. Oh, that counter. That would have been sick, too, because I know that if you do the upwards variant of the counter, you can actually combo it into other moves. Right, because they made, actually, they made a lot of counters faster, except for, like, Ikes. But, um... Yeah. And Bayos, obviously. Well, Greninja definitely benefits from it, and just getting, being kept on this ledge, if during the earlier game versus Poltergust, Seabass was keeping, uh... What's it called? Keeping Pold on ledge as long as possible. And now it seems like it's sort of like a vice versa sort of thing. Now he's the one being kept on ledge by Dyer. Right. And oh. yeah, oh, I didn't realize it went up that high. I mean, Dyer's gonna try to space out with Bear, try to you know hit him with Roll or something like, just to take out the stock. But oh. Okay, almost had a almost had a lock situation right there. That definitely, I, I feel like that would have been the kill with the amount of rage that uh, Seabass has. Seabass actually has been missing a lot of those drag down up air combos recently. Oh, okay. Um, Okay, very good recovery. Try to uh, just escape that bear. Back throw, not going to take it just yet. Uh, I think Dyer's been doing a really good job of managing his ink. You know, especially in the neutral, he always keeps just enough to be able to throw out a uh, splat bomb. And then once he gets him off stage, he doesn't necessarily go for the off stage things because he's going to go for his ink. That's right. Because that ink is super important. Just get, get out those splat bombs, hit him with jab, everything like that, you know? Es especially against a character who loves to dance on you like Greninja does, mm. you know? And uh, none the worse for wear for Seabass though. He's not. He's not. He's not that. Uh, he's not that far away from a kill on Dyer's stock right now. He's just got to take this stock as soon as he can before Dyer gets too much extra credit on this one right now. So I think Dyer and Seabass actually played earlier in uh, winners semis, uh, winners quarters, mm. and I think Dyer won that 2-0. So okay. we'll definitely have to see if Seabass has learned from that set. Now, do you know if Dyer played Inkling in that set too? I'm not 100 percent sure, but I think I saw the Inkling. Might be a fair bet since uh, he's going inkling this time around. All right, so definitely you're going to look. He's going to throw out a lot of back airs. Up throw, up air, not going to kill just yet. And I think now he's out of the kill window. Um, he's definitely going to be looking to get him off stage. He's very low on ink. So what's it called? Seabass has really got to capitalize on this right now. But he's right. going to land. Oh, I thought he was going to try to get ink. Yeah, there he is. It. Enough for the bomb. He's going to. Wow, that back air. Not going to hit that tag. Oh, there we go. Two frame. Get him off the ledge and get the nice back air right there. I mean, nice Seabass. Back nice back air. Nice I mean, Seabass is technically within killing, within like a few moves of killing Dyer, but this is Dyer. This isn't, I mean, you'd say, this is surprising that he's in loser semis at a low pull. Right. I mean, so, oh, the oh, down no. tilt. <laughs> oh, we're going to, I was going to say, are we going to see it again from Dyer? Dyer, no, please. Dyer is eluding death just as good as anybody can right now. Yeah. Inkling's got a lot of good aerials, and by a lot of good aerials, I mean back air. I, I agree. I agree. Oh, no. I, th I think Inkling's neutral air is actually a little bit deceptive. It does not look like the hitbox is as small as it is. You know, it's just like the legs at the top of his body. It's right, really so deceiving. Finally taking a stock, getting him out of rage, but uh, now he's back in uh, up throw, up air percent, keeping him off stage, hitting him with the, oh, ooh, just barely getting, <laughs> barely getting away from the splat bomb right there. I feel like that would have not made Seabass happy right there. Uh, okay, 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 okay. All right, <laughs> Dyer's kind of dancing right now. Doesn't quite get the up throw, up air, but he's not too worried about it. Gets it right there. That's going to be right. the game. A JB3 stock from Dyer coming out. It's All the right. game, man. Is this a uh, best two out of three? Still? Uh, I think all finals, I think everything until finals is two out of three. Two out of three. So Seabass has really got to bring this one together or else he's going to be looking at a looking at a solid fourth place on this one. Yeah, let me ask. Hey, Doc. Doc, is it two out of three or three out of five? All right, cool. Hey, Doc. Is it two out of three or three out of five? All right, so we're still two out of three until the next set, which will be Okami versus the winner. What is the Shulk? I'm... Surprised? Okay. Is this uh, is this a normal pick from Seabass? I haven't seen it all night. Uh, well, we're about to see it now. I mean, uh, speed. Shul Shulk versus Inkling. I I'm not am a speed. It feels like I we, we should know more about this matchup than we do, but we should know, know more about Shulk. But like all the Shulk, like they're like, yes, our character is good, and they're just sort of like waiting in the background. But you don't right. know anything about it. All right, <laughs> going to Shield. I, I mean, mean, I don't know. Nico's been doing really good. He um. That's one Shulk. There's so many more of them. I know. I know. They're scary. <laughs> got number two in SoCal. 
They scare me. <laughs> I can't even enter their Discord. Oh yeah, it's like a. <laughs> it's a. It's you to write an essay. Oh my. I can't. I, I can't even do that, man. Come on. I just want to learn the matchup. I just want to play Shulk. I, <laughs> it's like when you go to your own character Discord. Like, hey, how do I play against Shulk? I don't know. Go, go to Shulk Discord. <laughs> I was in the Ganon core during Smash 4, and I was like, hey, do we have a matchup chart? And they're like, yeah, we lose everything 7-3. Shut up. <laughs> All right, so I'm not sure how the show, how I'm feeling about the Shulk, but he's definitely he's definitely keeping it a lot closer than the other game. Uh, I'm just not sure how much he knows about Shulk. I'm sure that he, would be, he wouldn't be as confident as he was going against Dyer with it. That's the first time, like the first or second time I've seen Roller come out from Dyer tonight. Like, just right. in bracket. Are there necessarily any Shulks in CFL? Yes, uh, Frankenbean. Oh, okay. Oh, yeah, I saw him earlier. Yeah, I know he's here. All okay. right, so he has the grab. Not going for the up throw. I think the up throw actually might have killed there. Buster Monado. I'm not sure how safe that is, but I guess uh, with Shield Monado not being as good as it used to be, uh, that might be the best, most optimal uh, Monado for him to be in, just way down to Smash Monado. Right. It's definitely not as long as it was in Smash 4, but it definitely can keep you around a little bit longer. All right, so SDing. I think if he faced towards the ledge, he might have been. But I'm I'm just still more in shock about this pick. I've never seen anything like this out of, uh, out of Seabass. Going for the Shield Monado that quickly, though, might not be the best option. It might be easier to just take all those, but wow. Yeah, you'll, but, uh, you'll see Shulk uh, quite often, like in the middle of a combo, just go right into Shield Monado and just fall right out. Right, because Monado works in hit stun. So we're going to be seeing the Smash Monado soon. Uh, but also, Dyer went for that, uh, Dyer went for that dare, and, uh, he's not gonna take it yet. He's gonna smash, he's gonna fish for it with either grab or with, like, forward air, forward tilt. Right, or he could just keep throwing out these safe aerials, or, well, I wouldn't know how much, how, how safe I'll they were against somebody back. like Inkling. Definitely throw out those quick hitboxes with that guy. So I'm pretty sure Down most there. Shulk mains oh, wow. would prefer to be somewhere like, I don't know, like, in speed or jump Monado right now, just to get away from them. But he does know. I hope he does notice that he's out of thing, out of uh, ink right now, and he's got to recharge. But now he's got enough for that splat bomb, and taking it with Nair. There you go. He, he's got a he's got a hundred percent to catch up before Dyer takes the stock. So he's got he's got some catching up to do. But I wouldn't count out a Shulk to do that. <laughs> the dash grab, the pivot grab as shield Shulk. Here you go. All right. So trying to get some momentum. He's got a few hits on, but. Uh, yeah, he had a really good opportunity to make something happen right there, but Dyer just kind of jumped right out of that. And now he's almost an entire stock ahead in this game, too. So Seabass on this tournament stock right now. Really interesting that he went Shulk. Dyer looking to close this out again, uh, just get himself into losers' finals. But, yeah, uh, I don't know if this was a last effort pick from Seabass or anything, but I can't quite say if it's working out or not yet. Well, even if it does work out, he's got to win another game after this. And I'm not sure he has it in him, but I can only hope for him, you know? Exactly. I don't know. I think Dyer's staying in his face too much for Seabass to be too comfortable. I think Shulk really excels in keeping you just barely out of his zone. All right, so in Smash Monado already, not able to really punish that. That's kind of that's kind of busted that he couldn't punish the up B with, um, with like, up smash or something. Right. No, the, uh, the landing hit on that up B really kind of messes things up sometimes. I don't even under oh my god, oh, that's gonna be it! Dyer. That's gonna be it! <laughs> Did he dare him? Rest in peace, that's what music, I'm sorry. Oh my god. <laughs> hey, 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 hey. Boo doo 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 doo. Woo! Dyer. <laughs> Dyer is the true 